Hello YouTube, Matto here. Um, dragging and dropping Steam games. Now I recently reinstalled um, Windows and I wanted to get my, I've got a worse connection than I used to have so I can't really download my games anymore. Um, so I wanted to transfer them off my old drive onto my new drive. And I had a problem with this at first, I couldn't do it. And it used to be simple, you used to just drag the files and it would work. Now there's a slightly different technique to do it. And I looked around the internet and it took me quite a while to find out how to do this. So I'm making a YouTube video for you guys to hopefully help you along. Basically, all you have to do is go to your drive where you've got Steam already saved. Um, go to Edit Files, go to Common, find the game you want to transfer. In this case, we transfer Prison Architect. So you have to copy the game and then go to your C drive. Same thing. Find the Steam file, Steam apps folder, go into common, paste it in. I've already done it in this case, so we can skip that step. So you've pasted the game into the C drive from your external or whatever, your other spare internal drive. Now, the bit you need to do that they don't tell you about is find the corresponding app manifest ACF file. Now, to do this, all you have to do is find the game on Steam. So we want Prison Architect. So we Google Steam Store Prison Architect. Here it is. You can see already the L's here, but we'll just click on the game just to show you. Now in the L above, this number here is going to be the corresponding number to the ACF file you need to transfer. So in this case it's the 233450. So we grab this file, copy, and then we'd paste it, but not into the common file. We're going back one into the Steam Apps file and pasting it in here. Already done so, so that's working. Now, when you relaunch Steam, your game should appear in your library. All you have to do is click it and run it for the first time, and it'll produce, perform the first time setup. Now, just to show you, let's say we want to do Dota. So we go Steam Store Dota 2. And here it is. You can see it's 570. And lo and behold, 570 corresponds with my data too. And it's as simple as that. Hope this has helped you guys. Thanks for watching.